based on our current resources, we are very much under-testing the population. I, I actually don't agree with that. They're both on the same team, but very much on opposing sides. Dr. Sean Wormsbecker is an emergency room doctor at Royal Columbian and Eagle Ridge Hospitals. He took to YouTube this past weekend to voice concerns around what he considers to be a lack of testing for COVID-19 in BC. And then there's just a simple factor of, of, of human nature that um, there's a big difference between a uh, patient's perception when I say, oh, you probably have it, but you don't qualify for testing, so just go home and self-isolate. Now, obviously, I try to impart the urgency of this issue and the importance of it, but the, the, the fact of the matter is people don't take things as seriously when they don't feel that they sort of are, are sort of prioritized. In BC, testing is reserved for health care workers, those in hospital or long-term care homes, and those who are part of an outbreak investigation by health care officials. Our testing strategy, as I have explained a few times, has changed so that we are focused, uh, the large number of tests we're still doing, over 3,000 tests a day, we're focusing on those most likely to have this disease and those most likely to need um, health care or hospital care. So that is a, a, an important strategy. Dr. Henry acknowledges the testing strategy does likely mean there are more official cases in BC than what the stats show, which is 970. What the two doctors do agree on, physical distancing and self-isolation are what is best in the effort to keep the numbers down. Megan Batchelor, CBC News, Vancouver.